Yep, just cut myself. Ooh. What kind of sauce would you like? What's up, Hot Sauce fans? My name is Jeremy Blanchard, and this is Hot Sauce Fan. Here I have a, just a few selection, a few items of hot sauce here. What I do is I review hot sauces and tell you what I think about it, tell you what the heat level is, tell you, tell you if I like it, tell you the flavor, tell you whether or not it's garbage or whether or not it's really good. And if you could like and subscribe, and I would super appreciate it. Thank you so much for stopping by. I'm going to take my trusty little uh, sauce spoon here, and I'm going to try every single one of these. So stay tuned. Here we go, we got Captain Mowitz, or Mowitz. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. It's called Spitfire Sauce. It's named after a ship for Captain Mowitz. All right, so we got a little spoon here. I've already had some of this, so I really enjoy this hot sauce. It's, it's, it packs quite a punch, but it's not so overwhelming that you're gonna start hiccuping or get teary. So here you go. It's got uh, carrots, onion, water, lime juice, vinegar, garlic, salt, xanthan gum, and spices. It's eight fluid ounces. It's a huge bottle. You can see against the other ones. Really good, perfect. I love the heat. The heat is bordering like one, actually maybe, maybe two. Um, we got the classic hot sauce from Hot Ones. Uh, I believe the Puckerbutt make, company made this and I've already done a review on this. So if you want to find the video there or there or wherever I put it. <laughs> so it's got this little, um, I, keep, I kept calling it a lid, but it's like a, a flow thing. And I'm gonna take that off actually, because I, I hate that. <clears throat> it's really runny, very red hot sauce. Very vinegary, but very good if you're if you're not really into huge huge spice. It's a really good one. So we got that. We got Spitfire. We got Classic. We've got the Los Calientes. I did a video on this one as well. This one says it's a heat level at five out of ten, but I think it's more out of out of ten. I think it's more like a two or a three. We'll do this one. That is so good. Chili's Green Serrano. I definitely taste it. Apple smoked wood, I taste it. Really good. All right, we got uh, Switchback. Habanero Lime Switchback Craft Beer Hot Sauce. That's quite the mouthful. And this one tastes like beer. Cheers. Yeah, it's very bitter. Well, it's not bitter, it's just sour, I guess. I guess sour is more like it. Very good, I like it. It's awesome. It goes great with tacos and cocktails and seafood. I'm gonna do this one last. That's a triple X. I just got this in today. This little hot ones last dab original. That is awesome. I am so excited to try this. I haven't tried it yet. So let's do this one. First we feast hot ones. Ooh, it smells pretty hot. I'm gonna. It's, uh, it's very thick, like a mash. I'm gonna just do a little dab. I don't know if you can see it. Mouth on fire! Oh my God! Whoa! Oh. Okay, it wasn't that bad. But it is pretty hot. <laughs> um, huh. Oh, it's coming back. All right, so. This one I just did a video on is called Spicy Shark, and it's the original habanero. It's pretty dang good. My lip is burning from that one. Um, this one's super hot. I'd say on a heat level, it's probably a five, maybe a four. This one is really good. Very, very great color um, flavor profile. It says it's a three out of five medium heat, but it's got pepper, carrot, onion, apple, vinegar, habanero, pepper, lemon juice, banana. I won't go all through of them because they get less and less as they go on. But can you listen to that? Carrot, onion, apple, vinegar, habanero, pepper, lemon juice, banana, water, garlic, fennel. Fennel. Inter very, very interesting flavor pro profile. And it tastes like habanero and carrots to me. We've got Melinda's Extra Hot Pepper Sauce. Three out of five on the heat. 
scale. Uh, habanero, pepper mash, carrots, onion, lime, juice, vinegar, salt, garlic, citric acid, and xanthan, xanthan gum. Man, that hot one's... Woo, that is hot. I mean, you know, a lot of these people, they, they can go through the last dab and, you know, these and not, not have be too affected by it. But my mouth is on fire right now, and, and it's really because of this. Here's the Melinda's. This one has another one of those flow spouts. Mm, I love this one. I've, I've had this before. It's really, really good. Unfortunately, I can't find their hotter sauce because it's not in the store that I get it at. I was about ready to smell my spoon. It smells like wood. Oop, that's a lot. This one kind of, it's got some zing to it. After tasting all these, this tastes a little bland. It does taste like habanero though. Uh, it's got carrots as well, but it's um, a little more sour, kind of kind of uh, sourish like this one. The switchback. It's got a little heat to it, but it's not. Again, it's like a one one. I've never had this one. This one's siete hot sauce jalapeno. I'm gonna do a video, a more in depth video on this one. But oh. yep, just cut myself. Ooh. glass all over the place all right well i guess that'll do it for now i've got to clean this mess up and um try to and then i'll review these other ones i got another siete uh habanero hot sauce and then the last one the the triple x last dab thumbs up like subscribe for the analytics and for the blood sweat and tears that well there's no tears i didn't cry i promise don't ever do this. Next time I'll just peel it off instead of trying to force rip it off. All right, well, and then, uh, oh, I've got Sir Kensington's. It's a Korean inspired sauce, everything sauce, sort of like a, I'm guessing it's like a sriracha. Got this, thought I might try it. It's got a bunch of ingredients in it. I don't understand what they are, but I'm gonna try it nonetheless. See how hot that is. All right. Well, that's the end of this, and thank you for coming. I, I really appreciate it. Thumbs up, like, subscribe. This is, this is crazy. I can't believe that just happened. All right, see you later. Have fun. That sucked. All right.